person welcome or welcome back to my channel my name is Andy in today's video we are going to be reviewing a sugar wax brand in this in today's video the brand I am going to be reviewing is the wax by CE that's the name of the brand so I'm going to along the line or mid video I'll be sharing some clips or some b-roll that i took some days ago when i first got this brand and i unpackaged the brand uh the product so let's start with the first thing in their in their in their little package so when it came it came in a very nice um white bag i'm going to show the video here it came in a very nice white nicely designed bag um they are wax by ce sugar wax to a smooth and lumpless skin so the very first thing that came in the bag is their sugar wax this is the very first thing that came in their um in their pack it was this sugar wax and it's very very thick for someone who hasn't used um sugar wax before this was my very first time of using a sugar wax this was my very first time and i was completely stunned and pleasantly shocked by the thickness of this like it doesn't drop but if you leave it like this for a while say let's say 30 minutes or one hour it's going to you know it's you you'll see it will move but right at this point it doesn't move and because of that i was also really shocked when i tried to apply it that was my very first time and i had a little bit of difficulty applying it because i didn't expect it to be that that you know thick but of course it did its job i got a hang of it um during the process and i did what i had to do so there's that next thing that it comes with are these wooden spatulas that you know you can use to get the sugar wax from here to here and my problem is that i kind of felt like these were soft i felt like if i wasn't careful with this that these would break in there i wish they came this came with something that was not wooden okay something um stronger Okay, I've seen some waxing videos or sugar wax videos. Usually the spatulas that come with it are not wooden. So because it was wooden, I there was a little bit of difficulty when I was trying to apply. But of course, it was my first time too, so probably it's just me. The next thing that it came with are these bags, okay? These bags of strips. As you can see, I've used these. They are, re they, they are reusable though. This is the first one that is unopened. This is the second one. It comes to the number of strips in each one. This one is not complete though. Two are not in here. So for this, it comes with like four inside here. Right now, two is not in here. Two is I washed them and I hung them. So this is what is left in here. So this is another bag and they are reusable so whenever you use them um, according to your to their directions and what i did you just soak them in water and just a little scrub you can you may or may not add soap and the wax will wash off and you can use them the next time when you want to wax so the next thing that came in was this white powder that was another thing this is another thing that i didn't really like so much that it was small but then again you don't need so much so and also i did message the the owner the brand owner and she said that it that you are free to purchase any brand of white powder as far as it is white powder she says no um oil free powders no colored powders none of that just regular white powder can be used to refill this when it's full so there's that so this you use this um on the area that you want to um wax to get rid of the oil and then of course you apply your sugar wax and then 
put on the strip and wax the next thing it came with is this calming oil which you use after your waxing process um according to them this is supposed to i don't know did they write it somewhere they didn't write it somewhere but i am i'm thinking this is supposed to soothe the area that you use it on so when i first applied this it has a very it wasn't what i expected it has this minty soothing feel on the skin um there are three oils that are in here but because of the where the print is i can't really see the other two oils but i know that one of such one of the oils in here is shea butter but i can't see what the other oils say i don't know if you can see i don't know if i can focus this for you to see that i can't really see what is written in there that's one thing i would say they should improve on on their print so it's easy for people to read what's written on their products the next thing that they had in here was their card their little complimentary card and it was actually really nice it has them saying thank you for your patronage and at the back here it has directions for use so what was my overall experience with using this brand i don't know if that focus did it did it did it get in focus did it? i don't know has it gotten in focus though okay so what was my overall experience with this brand it was my first time exactly okay it was my first time using a sugar wax kit so i do not have something or a reference to compare it to but i would say that i enjoyed the experience it was very exciting it was my first time and it did get the hairs off okay it did get the hairs off it was painful <laughs> oh my god it was painful but one thing that i didn't do right during this whole the whole waxing process was not exfoliating before waxing which is which is a very very bad thing you're supposed to exfoliate before you shave you wax whatsoever but i was thinking i don't know i was just so excited to use the product so i i just went ahead and skipped waxing altogether but when i used to shave okay i did used to exfoliate before shaving but i didn't exfoliate before waxing I did, and i didn't think it would be that bad so i ended up with of course after shave I, I i ended up with bumps not after shave bumps but i did get ingrown hairs so that is the mistake and i would sound this as a kind of warning please if you're going whatever you're going to do any hair removal stuff you want to do on your hair make sure on your body not hair any hair removal treatment that you want to do please exfoliate before you go ahead with it whether you are shaving or you are waxing sugar wax whatever kind of wax please exfoliate or else you're going to end up with ingrown hairs and those bumps trust me you don't want those um how long did this last it lasted much longer than a regular shave shaving lasts for me personally it doesn't last for one week it lasts for four days four days at the very most four days five days and they are back like they never left but these i, I when i waxed it i stayed clean and hair free for two weeks that was the that's the longest i have ever gone after a hair removal process or hair removal routine so this i would give it 10 out of 10 okay 10 out of 10 what i experienced the bumps and the um the ingrown hairs that i had was purely purely my fault because i didn't exfoliate thereafter so that is the review for this product wax by ce you can check them out on instagram um if you're interested they are uh, currently present in nigeria aquabum state to be exact aquabum state nigeria so if you want to patronize them you can head over to their instagram and check them out so yeah 
that is it for today's video thank you so much for watching if you like this video make sure you hit the like button and subscribe down below and also turn on your post notifications so that you can be notified each and every time i post useful videos like this thank you so much for watching and let me know in the comment section how do you go about your hair removal processes or routines do you shave do you do laser treatments or do you wax which of them have you used have you used all three and which of them do you prefer let me know in the comment section down below and yeah that's it so i'll see you in my next video guys bye Oh, 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 oh,